have my thanks. Chancellor. Gentlemen, this is my daughter, Azed Boer. My military advisor, Brigadier Kurla. And this is General Chang, my chief of staff. I have so wanted to meet you, Captain. I'm not sure how to take that. Sincere admiration, Kirk. From one warrior to another. Right. Now, this way, I think you might enjoy a brief tour. They all look alike. What about that smell? You know only top-of-the-line models can even talk. And... You men have work? Yes, yes ma'am. Ma then snap to it. I offer a toast. The undiscovered country. The future. The undiscovered country. Hamlet, Act Three, Scene One. You have not experienced Shakespeare until you have read him in the original Klingon. Tach, ta, tach, bech. Captain Kirk. I thought Rummy Linnell was illegal. One of the advantages of being a thousand light years from Federation headquarters. To you, Chancellor Gorka, one of the architects of our future. Chancellor. 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 Bye -bye. Perhaps we are looking at something of that future here. Tell me, Captain Kirk, would you be willing to give up Starfleet? <clears throat> I believe the captain feels that Starfleet's mission has always been one of peace. Uh, far be it for me to dispute my first officer. But Starfleet has always been in a war. Captain, there's no need to mince words. In space, all warriors are cold warriors. Uh, General, are you fond of Shakespeare? We do believe all planets have a sovereign claim to inalienable human rights. Inalien, if you could only hear yourselves. Human rights, why the very name is racist. The Federation is no more than a homo sapiens only club. Uh, present company accepted, of course. In any case, we know where this is leading. The annihilation of our culture. That's not true. No. No. To be or not to be. That is the question which preoccupies our people, Captain Kirk. We need breathing room. Earth, Hitler, 1938. I beg your pardon. Well, I see we have a long way to go. We must do this again sometime. You don't trust me, do you? I don't blame you. If there is to be a brave new world, our generation is going to have the hardest time living in it. Captain Spock? Chancellor? Madam? Captain. 
Well, most kind. Parting is such sweet sorrow. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Captain, have we not heard the chimes at midnight? Thank God. Did you see the way they ate? Parable table manners. I doubt that our own behavior will distinguish us in the annals of diplomacy. I'm going to sleep this off. Please let me know if there's some other way we can screw up tonight. I'm going to go find a pot of black coffee. <laughs> 